Hey there fitness enthusiasts. Welcome back to my channel, where we dive deep into all things health and wellness. In today's video, we're going to tackle a topic that has been intriguing and challenging for many, body recomposition. That's right. We're going to learn how to lose fat and gain muscle at the same time. Are you tired of having to choose between building muscle and losing fat? Well, what if I told you that it's possible to achieve body recomposition? Where you can simultaneously build muscle and shed those unwanted pounds? Many people believe that body recomposition is only for a select few. But I'm here to tell you that it's more achievable than you think. Debunking the myth. Let's bust a common myth right off the bat. Body recomposition is not limited to beginners. Research has shown positive body recomposition in seasoned athletes, like pro football players lifting serious weights. Even women preparing for bodybuilding shows have been found to gain muscle during their extreme. So, it's definitely possible for most individuals to achieve body recomposition. Overcoming the challenge. The major challenge with body recomposition is that building muscle and losing fat are two opposing goals. Typically, a calorie deficit is required to lose fat, which can hinder muscle growth. However, with the right approach to nutrition and training, we can signal our bodies to use existing fat stores as energy while building muscle. So, how do we do this? Step 1. Nutrition. The first step towards body recomposition is optimizing your nutrition. Calorie intake plays a crucial role. While you need to be in a calorie deficit to stimulate fat loss, it shouldn't be as aggressive as during a typical dieting phase. Research suggests that a deficit of around 300 calories allows for muscle growth while losing fat. Shots of healthy, balanced meals showcasing a combination of lean proteins, complex carbohydrates, and healthy fats. Step 2. Body Fat Percentage To maximize body recomposition, we need to consider body fat percentage. A recent case study revealed that as individuals get leaner, becomes less likely, and muscle loss becomes inevitable beyond a certain level of leanness. While the exact minimum body fat required for recomposition is not entirely clear, a good minimum guideline is around 15% for males and at least 22% for females. Step 3. Setting Goals Now, let's talk about setting goals. It's essential to prioritize your main objective during body recomposition. If you're already quite lean or have been training consistently for over six months, body recomposition may be more challenging for you. Additionally, consider whether building muscle or losing fat is your primary focus at the moment. While you might gain some muscle during recomposition, if building muscle is your primary goal, the power of sleep. Sleep, the often underestimated factor in body recomposition. Discover its impact on muscle growth and fat loss. Our research-backed tips on optimizing sleep duration and quality will ensure you make the most of your hard work in the gym and kitchen. Conclusion There you have it, my fellow fitness warriors. Body recomposition is not only possible but a transformative approach to achieve your dream physique. Don't settle for conventional methods, unlock the power of simultaneous muscle gain and fat loss.